morning, good morning. How's everybody doing this Saturday morning? I am doing much better now. Just got a little bit of driving behind me and I stopped in Nipagon for what? Guess what? For this thing right here. Tim Hortons. Yeah, they got the Christmas theme going on right now, eh? Yep, yeah, that's it. So we are all good to go. Probably uh, put her in gear here any second now and then we'll be on our way home. So enjoy the ride, come along with me and see what uh, what I see today. I just stopped up here in uh, Agnes, Ontario. Got a little uh, bit of a asso, not really a truck stop, but trucks can park here just to go in and grab a sandwich or something like that or use the bathroom or whatever, you know. They don't permit uh, trucks parking here overnight, but uh, they got subway in here, you know, so I figured I'll go grab me a subway sandwich and uh, probably also uh, clean my mirrors. I think uh, I think it's almost time to go ahead and clean them, eh? You can't really see anything in them anymore, so I think it's about time to go ahead and clean them, you know? That's just what winter will do for you. You know, uh, slushy roads, you know, and then you gotta clean your windshield uh, you know with windshield washer fluid and it gets all over on my, my mirror especially on the driver's side so it gets all super dirty so I'm gonna go clean that and get me a sawbiz sandwich and put the hammer down towards home just take a look at my truck I think it's due for a truck wash eh? look at the mess it's made yeah, it's a pretty uh, pretty messy day out here today it's not cold it's not really cold at all I guess if you're out for a while, I guess you've got cold, but not really super cold. Finish cleaning my mirror. <clears throat> Just gonna take my shoes off. There we go. Got her back in the truck. Yeah. Well, let's just take a look in there. No, you can see in the mirror. Cleaned it up real nicely. Got me my subway sandwich done. So now I'm all ready to roll. So let's get going. Here we go. We got her in gear. And now we are rolling. <clears throat> we'll get out of here. All right. West Street, and then turn left in 70 meters. I already told my wife earlier, I said, uh, I am definitely going to go wash the truck today once I get home. Uh, go home Proceed and to the highlighted route. hug and kiss the wife and uh, kids and then uh, I'm going to go take my son with me and uh, going to go wash the truck, you know. Because uh, I want to get that salt off of my truck as soon as I can because that is uh, not very good for the metal, I guess. If you got a lot of salt on the vehicle, it will rust. The vehicle will rust sooner, you know. But uh, yeah, it seems to be a good day today. Uh, it's not too cold. Right now, it's not snowing. It was snowing a little bit earlier. Nothing to be worried about, but. Uh, certainly was snowing a little bit but uh, yeah that's supposed to go uh, abo above zero degrees Celsius today so uh, I guess we will have some melting snow which we usually get but I uh, certainly hope it doesn't uh, get too warm especially up there in Buffalo area I heard that they're uh, uh, really worried about getting floods with all that snow that they got in some areas they got over seven feet of snow up there so yeah that can't be very good um <clears throat> I don't know what I would do if I get that much snow man and then they were expecting to get rain uh, yeah they were really worried about if they even entire if they get rain on top of all the snow that they already got uh, that might be an insulator for the rain <clears throat> and it might cause uh, roofs to collapse from all the weight from the snow and then on top uh, you know get all that rain on top of it yet so uh, 
yeah hopefully nobody gets hurt but hey I guess that's part of life and just have to figure out a way to live with it I guess but, uh, yeah so we got about another uh, I would say about the four four and three quarter hours till we get home about uh, 430 kilometers right now to get home and uh, that will probably take us about four and three quarter hours of driving here in Ontario since it's lower speed limit well, we got a few towns we gotta go through yet and all that stuff you know but uh, yeah so we'll uh, we'll make her home today I'll be home tomorrow and then probably go in on Monday again hope all of you guys had a uh, good Thanksgiving I'm saying this right now because <laughs> I know you're gonna be watching this a week after so uh, I didn't think about it on Thursday so well I guess I'll go say it now and uh, yeah we uh, we invited some friends for uh, tomorrow night so uh, we'll show you then what happens then but uh, yeah but uh, we will continue rolling home and uh, have a good time off. I guess uh, we'll try and get a load out on Monday. Hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to still get some good miles in next week because of that Thanksgiving day on Thursday. This ain't looking too good. Got a rolled over truck up here it looks like. Yeah, tool truck is up here trying to unload everything it looks like onto another truck at least that's what it looks like to me yeah he laid her all over that's for sure looks like they already picked up the truck yeah, I got all kinds of stuff going on up here oh boy ha look at this four wheeler here eh? Oh, I got stuck up there. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. That must have been bad for that guy. Alright, we have just dropped our trailer here at the terminal here in Steinbach. I am home sweet home pretty much. Just got to drive to the house and that's it. Finished doing all my paperwork. Yep. Go home and uh, we'll say hi to the kids and, uh, and the wife. I'll pick up my son and then uh, we'll go wash the truck. Yeah, it's a much needed truck wash. As I showed you guys earlier, it's really, really super dirty. So we'll go do that and then. Uh, Spend the evening with the wife and kids. Yep, that's what we will be doing. So with that, we'll get on our way, and uh, I guess we'll talk to you guys uh, later on. Alrighty, I am done for today. I made it home, washed the truck. Truck is nice and clean now, but now I am dirty, as you can see. But that's a man's work, I guess. And I got a do things yourself sometimes you know filled up the uh, windshield washer fluid on the truck and uh, just realized that I ran out completely out of uh, windshield washer fluid at home so next time I come home or whatever I'm gonna have to get me some more windshield washer fluid you know winter time you use a lot of windshield washer fluid so but anyways I'm gonna go inside and spend the time with the with the kids and the family you know so uh, thanks for watching We'll see you guys again tomorrow. Bye.